Hello guys, welcome to IC Maths class. I'm going to be solving the quantitative, financial quantitative reasoning test theory example A, that's for parameter 6. So I've done the example, we got the A, we got this by finding the square of this and the square of this, then you subtract. But before I comment, don't forget to like, comment, on, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell button of my YouTube channel. So you'll be the first to get notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you so much. So like I said, I got this. By finding the square of this and the square of this, then I subtract. Square of 10 is 100, while square of 7 is 49. Then I subtracted 100. 100 minus 49, which gave me 51. Same thing I did here. I found the square of 15 and the square of 12. Then... I subtracted 20 that's 225 225 subtracted um by one 144 which gave me 81 so that's how i got this find the square of this the square of this we subtract then for number one i found the square of 20 and the square of 17 the square of 20 was 400 white square of 17 was 289 then when i subtracted i got this but it's not in the auction, so just for me to, I think they actually made a mistake here because um, this one, the one zero, I think it's a mistake, so you can just as well write your answer here in the empty space. Yeah, I sincerely take it off, it's a mistake. Number two, and also remember, you can send videos. Um, if you don't understand any concerning mass and positive reasoning you can just post it on my comment section and be sure to get a reply within an hour thank you number two so this place is empty we'll put this empty space as x so therefore the square of this subtracted from the square of 9 will give me 40 so we have to find out what is this x which is x squared minus 81 because square of 9 is 81 equals to 40 so i have to make x alone which is 40 plus that is minus 81 equals to the plus 81 x is equals to 1 2 1 that's x squared so we are looking for what is x now not x squared so we are going to this square root for both sides to so find out x this square root so we divide this square which will be x is equals to the square root of 1 2 1 and the square root of 1 2 1 is what 11 so our answer here is 11 we take our 11 we write it here so check if we are correct you can say say 11 square which is 1 2 1 subtracted from 9 square that's 81 1 2